Point is celebrating the 4th of July in more ways than one. News 9's Nick Robinson was in Point all day with what you can look forward to and tonight and throughout the weekend. There's no shortage of red, white and blue here in Stevens Point. Folks started the day here at the downtown square for the city's annual 4th of July parade. First responders, veterans and businesses busted out their parade floats and headed around the square to celebrate Independence Day, some throwing out treats to the crowd. Mayor Mike Wiesa says it's important to take a moment to remember why we celebrate the day and who we have to thank for it. Of course, we're here to uh, first and foremost to honor our veterans and uh, on, on Independence Day. But uh, everybody puts on a great show here. Everybody having fun? Yeah! There you go. Several of those veterans were in attendance, marching down the street in their uniforms and receiving lots of applause. As you can see, the 4th of July parade brought out a huge crowd. But that's not the only thing going on this weekend. Let's go see what they got going on at Riverfront Rendezvous. The Rendezvous is a staple of Stevens Point in the summer with plenty of rides, food, and of course, music. But this isn't just any Riverfront Rendezvous. This year, they're celebrating their 40th anniversary. Tom Glavin and his family were among the folks enjoying the festival. He said they don't usually come to Riverfront Rendezvous, but after experiencing it this year, they might have to change their minds. Well, we were looking for something to do on the 4th of July, and we heard this, is the, I think it's the 40th year for Riverfront, so we thought we'd check it out. We heard they had some rides this year, and thought it'd be fun for the kids. And you've still got plenty of time to enjoy it. The festival runs all the way through Saturday night and concludes with a big fireworks show. 40 years later, Riverfront Rendezvous is still going strong. In Stevens Point, Nick Robinson, News 9, WAOW.